Hi guys, so today we're gonna unbox the Cordless Resin Mixer Pro. I'm actually gonna unbox it and then I'm gonna give it a try, see how it works out. So, you see it's boxed pretty good. Uh, it's got a little tape right here to keep everything sealed. So this is actually sealed pretty tight. It's packaged pretty good, I would say. It's got these cards. It's got some instructions there. And as you can see, it comes with four, four mixers. It's plastic, so I guess my only concern would be uh, the cleaning of it or feel like the resin could get stuck in here pretty easy it's got four of them oh. so I guess this doesn't come with any batteries We'll open this up. Let's take a look here. So it doesn't come with batteries. It uses AAA. And this is where I'm screwed because I actually don't have any AAA batteries on hand. All right, so I'm back. I was able to actually find batteries upstairs. So I'm gonna give this a try again. It, oh, it actually uses four, so it uses one here, one here. Oh, this is on. So this is a little confusing. Or maybe, shoot, is there anything smaller than AAA? Okay, so when you pop the batteries in there, you're gonna need to put some force in. But anyways, as you can see, you can just pop it in there. Not need any more. There you go. So you line it up just like that. And so these little sticks, you just put them in there. They're going by pressure. So you just stick it in. If you want to take it out, you just pull it out and then put it in. And let's see. There you have it. You can reverse it. You can go forward or clockwise, counterclockwise. And there you go. And then I'll give it some I guess we just put it in there and turn it. So it looks like it's doing a pretty good job actually. Yeah, but overall, the mixing is pretty good. I think it's actually the cleaning that I'm gonna have a problem with. just so it gets small a little better. And this is a Clorox wipe. I'm going to put a napkin. So I got paper towel. See how good it actually is. Okay. 
Oh. Um, I guess it's all right. It'd be better if this was silicone. It's not too difficult to clean. I recommend that you actually just clean it right away. Don't let the resin have any time to cure on this. But, yep, there you go.